One of America's first animal welfare institutions has a big celebration coming up to make sure they can continue their life-saving mission. The 26th Morris Animal Refuge Furball is this Friday, and Louis Czechia is the executive director and joins us this morning. Louis, how you doing? Good, how you doing, Anya? Fantastic. Uh, Louis, first, talk about your organization and the incredible work that you guys do. Sure. Uh, Mars Animal Refuge has uh, been in continuous operation since 1874. We're a life-saving organization and we uh, take in homeless and abandoned animals and we look to um, adopt out uh, every animal that we can and we have a, currently a 98% save rate and we love being part of animal welfare in the city of Philadelphia. And there's still an urgent need for animals to find forever homes. Uh, what would you say are some of the recent adoptable pets that you've had at Morris? Oh, we've had, uh, of course, we have our fair share of kittens, uh, but we get our share, you know, we get we get a good share of uh, certainly healthy animals, but then we get some really challenging cases, some special needs cases. We have a, a beautiful uh, pit bull uh, named Dior, and she is absolutely wonderful. She's deaf. Uh, she can't hear, so she's uh, looking for a special home, somebody that can take the time, has the resources um, and energy to really work with her so that they can have her adapt to the household and be a loving companion. And uh, fortunately, there's a, lot, there's a lot of solutions to help with uh, deaf animals in the house. And um, it, we've had deaf animals before and they get adopted out and they turn into wonderful pets. And of course, the furball is ho um, helping to get these animals adopted. Unfortunately, it is sold out for this Friday, but there is a virtual auction that everyone can participate in. What are the details about that? Yeah, there's a, if, if you go into phillyfurball.com, uh, there's a silent auction that's up and it's for the people, you know, who can't make the furball. Uh, and it's basically you bid and uh, auction on. We have uh, a trip to Cancun. Uh, we have sports tickets. We have all kinds of adventure packages and experiences. That's what people really seem to like the most we found from our auctions. And just either a night out for dinner, a night out to a show or a play. Uh, and we've been adding them every day. Uh, and it'll all culminate on the furball, but uh, you don't need to be the furball to win. It's all virtual and it's a lot of exciting stuff. So I encourage everybody to check it out and see uh, what, what they like. Awesome. A lot of opportunities for people to help these amazing animals find some forever homes. Once oh. again, the Morris Animal Refuge Furball is this Friday, March 24th at the Franklin Institute in Center City, Philadelphia. And for more details about Morris's life-saving work, the virtual auction, and animals looking for yep. permanent, loving homes. I see an animal <laughs> walking across there right now. I love that. Yeah, this is this is Mr. Cow. He's uh... Mr. Cow. I don't know why he's named that, but... Uh, <laughs> he wants to encourage people. He wants to show people how loving animals can be. You see that? You can you can have your own Mr. Cow if you participate in all of this that's happening. So for all those details, just head over to the Philly Live section of NBC10.com or the NBC10 app. Louis Czechia, Mr. Cow, thank you so much for joining us today on Philly Live. Yeah, thank you so much.